What is artificial intelligence? Intelligence demonstrated by machines in contrast to the natural intelligence displayed by humans and animals. AI is generally divided into two subdivisions that are symbolic learning and machine learning. Now, robotics. It is the subdivision of symbolic learning which creates intelligent and efficient robots. Okay. Computer vision. Computer vision focuses on extracting information from input images or videos just like the human brain does. For example, when a human brain sees the flower, it tries to inform extract the information such as its shape, color, etc. Examples of computer visions are face detection, object detection, handwriting detection. One of the method for computer vision is image processing, which is used to focus on processing the raw input images. For example, it is used to apply transformation to the images such as sharpening the image, stretching the image, rescaling image that is zoom in, zoom out, changing the tones of image, etc. Now let's talk about the speech recognition. Speech recognition is the study of speech signals and processing methods of signals. Examples such as Google Assistant, Siri, Alexa. Okay, when someone speaks to Google Assistant, that call home. Call home means it will try to recognize the voice of the person which wants to call at his, their home. Let's talk about chatbots. Chatbots which talks to us, responds to our messages and deals with our language this thing comes under the nlp yes nlp is natural language processing deals with the study of language created by humans such languages as hindi english gujarati nlp is further divided into two parts that are nlu and nlg NLU means natural language understanding, which is used to extract positive and negative sentiments from the text. For example, when someone comes to Siri and say, I want to connect to Neha on call right now and please dial Neha's number. These are the two different sentences with same intent but different expressions under the natural language understanding. Now, what is NLG, Natural Language Generating? It is used to generate new text, that is, a chatbot responses to our text, like Google Assistant responses us. Now, the combination of NLU and NLG both used to processing the existing text to generate the new text or extracting information out of it is combinedly said natural language processing this speech recognition and nlp comes under the statistical learning and statistical learning comes under machine learning so what is machine learning it learns from the data in order to build models that give accurate predictions to find patterns with particularly unseen data Machine learning is again divided into three types that are supervised learning, unsupervised learning and reinforcement. Now what is supervised learning? A supervised learning have two things X and Y. X will be the input and Y will be the output that is the labeled data. Examples of supervised learning such as to find weather condition which time of the day it is, holidays in the month, price of the house. Supervised learning is further subdivided into two parts that are classification and regression. Classification means it will have two classes or more than that, such as one class is for 
cat and another class as of dog now a machine has to find that which image is of the given image is of dog or cat and regression will give single output such as house price prediction and supervised learning and unsupervised learning will both have training data as a part of learning what is unsupervised learning unsupervised learning will have input but no correct output that is the model can detect when people are smiling based on the correlation of facial patterns but the reasons of why the person is smiling can be many such as he got the award he got his dream job etc so for that unsupervised learning will be used so the third one is reinforcement learning reinforcement learning the area of machine learning in absence of training data set used to learn from its experience for example it allows ai to play games yes when someone needs to find best possible path reinforcement learning is used now we are going to talk about pattern recognition a pattern recognition which attempts to assign each input value to one of a given set of classes for example we have, we want to find that a given mail is spam or non spam at that time pattern recognition is used patterns can be found in form of words numbers symbols schedules behavior etc pattern recognition is also the subfield of machine learning deep learning the subset of machine learning which resembles the neurons so moving towards deep learning the subset of machine learning which resembles neural connections that exist in human brain neurons used to transmit data in form of input and output values through connect connections and deep learning associated with that transformation comes under the neural network the given network that used to scan images from left to right top to bottom and recognize the objects in the scene comes under the cnn that is convolutional neural network now as humans have the ability to remember their past as human can remember what he was wearing yesterday that thing is done in rnn that is recurrent neural network which is used to remember a limited past